Research has shown that women who have ventured into construction to make ends meet or simply for career satisfaction have had to endure discrimination, harassment and other challenges. Hii kazi yetu yenyewe iko na changamoto lakini bidii yako ndio inakufikisha hapo. Now like me na operate na wanaume. Operators wangu wote ama tunafanya nao kazi ni wanaume I'm the only lady. Operating heavy machines is what Evelyn Chepkoech does best. The sight of a female plant operator, a rare one because road construction has for a long time been identified with men. When it comes to dealing with the machines, these machines zote usipo concentrate nazo, utaweza kuioperate. So kila kitu ni kuconcentrate kwa hiyo machine, ndio uweze kufanya. Chepkoech says women are capable of doing construction work and has earned respect from her male counterparts for her work ethic. Unapata kwamba watu wameconcentrate kwako. Sasa wanaonanga, eh, kwani mwanamke anaoperate hii machine? How? She urges women to pursue training on construction so that they can be competent in the field. Nilianza kufanya nilikuwa na uoga. Eh, ukiendanga na machine mahali unapata kuwa umeattract attention ya watu karibu wote kila mtu anakuona mpaka inakupatia hiyo uoga unashtuka unakuwa na hiyo tension but with time venye niliendelea hivyo nikakuwa na hiyo courage On gender discrimination in the industry the plant operator is optimistic that women too will be awarded tenders in road construction as perception has worked to the disadvantage of women who bid for road construction contracts Hii kazi yetu ni ya minority si kazi ya watu wengi sasa sababu watu wengi wanaona ni kama ni kazi ngumu kazi ngumu sababu hata kuna wanaume hawawezi wakafikia hapo hata waambiwa wafanye wanaona ugumu lakini kwangu naona hakuna kazi ngumu so na encourage ladies sana sana wa come up waende waende hii course yenye nimeenda ni kazi mzuri Chep coach is living up to the controversial adage that what a man can do a woman can do better